earlier this afternoon in Moss Point, Mississippi, with numerous reports of uprooted trees, down power lines, as well as homes and buildings that were severely damaged. So let's get the latest on the situation there in Jackson County, Mississippi. We're going to bring in Sheriff John Ledbetter. Sheriff Ledbetter, thank you for telling us. What can you tell us so far with the latest of this confirmed tornado? Well, I'm on the ground here in Moss Point on Main Street. Uh, about two hours ago, had a tornado come through, damaged a lot of homes, a lot of businesses, severe damage to uh, banks, other structures, churches. Uh, uh, from what I've been told, there are no fatalities. Thank goodness, no fatalities. Uh, some minor injuries, but a lot of structural damage here in Moss Point. Yeah, we're looking at video out of Moss Point, and you can see some of the homes that took a hit. So I'm so sorry that your community is going through this, and I know you're out there working some of the neighborhoods and trying to get through and speak to people. We did have earlier some unconfirmed reports that people may have been trapped in some of the damage. Have you heard anything more about that or able to confirm any of those details? Yes, ma'am. Merchants and Marine Bank here on Main Street in Moss Point, there were customers and uh, employees inside that were trapped. There were no injuries. But as of the last 30 minutes, they've been uh, they've been rescued from the building. They're all out. Everyone's in good condition. There are still some reports of home being checked uh, coming in throughout the city. Uh, but everything that we've uh, checked and everything that other uh, first responders have checked is all clear. It's great news to hear people being able to get rescued. No fatalities so far. Sheriff Ledbetter, I want to ask you for the estimate on the extent of damage here because we've had uh, flooding, catastrophic flooding in a nearby state in Alabama. We've had wind gusts 90 miles per hour throughout the day. What other type of damage are you experiencing there in Moss Point? Well, the I mean, even after the tornado passed through, we had a lot of heavy rain. I'm talking several inches in just a short amount of time. Uh, flooding uh, in, in the city of Pascagoula. Uh, obviously, just a, the concentration of the damage was in the city of Moss Point, but a lot of, a lot of high winds, a lot of rain. Uh, I, I see the sun out now to the, to the north and west of us, so hopefully this is past us for now. Hopefully we can continue to check buildings and structures and uh, start the recovery process. Yeah, I was looking at Moss Point, for those not familiar, um, southern part of Mississippi. It's it's just south of I-10. And this is an area that's been hit pretty hard with some heavy rain lately and not too far away to the east. We have those flash flood emergencies going on. Um, you know, in terms of people that have lost their homes or people that where their home is just so damaged, they're not going to be able to sleep there, especially with the ongoing threat of severe weather and rain. How many families at this point do you think are going to need to find that secondary shelter in the meantime until they can can get back into their home it's it's too early to tell i've run across just a few because i'm standing on the ground here trying to direct them around the damage uh obviously the vehicles are still drivable I'm trying to get them around the, the affected area because they've already talking about uh evacuating and find another place to stay for the night so i'm tens of you know it's it, it really can't tell but there are several mm -hmm. families Get out their home tonight. Typical and so tough to see this when we're watching more of that damage video coming in. Real quickly, Sheriff Ledbetter, with your experience, have you seen any type of storms like this recently that have kind of your community has gone through, whether it's a hurricane or tornadoes? No, so they're not as recent. I mean, you're right here, and we're uh, very experienced in, in hurricanes, that is, but it is. It's, there's obviously advanced warning with hurricanes, storms like this uh, that, that produce tornadoes. This was quick and unexpected as of today. Here in recent weeks and months, we have had storms that brought hail to the area, unlike the weather down here. We haven't seen hail. We had it uh, as it yesterday reported in this area. Yeah, Mississippi having some incredibly large hail in recent days. And, and that hail, I mean, to stretch that far south and to see quite a bit of it, um, not something you see necessarily all the time, especially in severe season. Well, we wish you the best of luck. I know you're on the ground and you're busy helping out those who need it most. Jackson County, Mississippi Sheriff John Ledbetter, we wish you the best of luck moving forward. And I'm sure we'll be checking in with you in the future. Thank you.
I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.